10 years of Modi's government, the diplomacy, the Modi diplomacy is world class. Eight sailors returning from Qatar who are sentenced to death sentence without a scratch. The old India can never do this. New India is doing it. Right from day one we are demanding this. It's a victory to BJP. But we know but their intention is not honest in making a corrupt minister to resign. Intention is not honest. I think the DMK is trying to get bail to Sendil Balaji by saying, see, he has resigned his ministership post. And more than that, his brother is also absconding for the last eight months. People are watching this drama. People are watching this misuse of power by the DMK government for a long time. I hope and pray that anybody who is corrupt, anybody who has the power in DMK government to come out and disturb the witnesses will continue to remain in jail for a longer period. Sir, yesterday's the prepared governor's address is a bundle of lies. Yesterday, through a press release, we have detailed 10 lies in that one particular document. How it is not only lie, it is a state government which has got a bounden duty to tell truth, is actively lying. Be it the investments to Tamil Nadu, be it the protection of SEST brothers here, be it the introduction of new schemes, which is a central government scheme, only the sticker is pasted, and be it many other issues, including the GST component from 2017 to 2022, post that Tamil Nadu government demanding extra compensation. We have point by point with the data punctured all the lies of DMK government. Expecting governor to speak those lies, I don't think it is nice and right. So that is why governor and his wisdom has decided not to speak. And governor has gracefully allowed the speaker to say, you have to understand it. And the speaker read the Tamil statement of the prepared text. What the board the speaker did is, he deliberately insulted the governor who was sitting in the house watching the proceeding. The governor did not have any other choice than to walk out of the house. That is what has happened. The governor has also clarified late in the evening yesterday. So the speaker, I think he is looking for a seat for his son or daughter for the Lok Sabha. The speaker of Tamil Nadu Assembly is behaving worse than a DMK card holding member. So I don't think any sane person should take the speaker's statement very seriously because the speaker of Tamil Nadu has lost his mind. He has to go and get his head examined. Sir, generally, 10 years of Bodhiji's government, the diplomacy, the Modi diplomacy is world class. Just yesterday we have seen eight sailors returning from Qatar who are sentenced to death sentence without a scratch. That is a victory to Narendra Modi ji, victory to our external affairs ministry under the leadership of Jay Shankar ji. The old India can never do this. New India is doing it. Also the fishermen released from Sri Lankan prison today morning, 10 fishermen landed in Chennai. Our BJP candidates have gone there to give them a warm welcome. So gone are the days of shooting, killing fishermen in the high sea. Now, even when an arrest happens in, a, in the quickest possible time, we are getting back all the fishermen to the Tamil soil. Sir, everything is going on track. As of now, we are focusing on party, we are opening offices, we are mobilizing our cadres, we are motivating our cadres. As and when the time is right, our senior leaders, parliamentary board, they are, they are there to take care of the alliance. When the time is right, we will speak to you more about that.